welcome to a new vlog i just finished my breakfast just very quick and easy wit picks i try and eat in the morning i've tried to do this for months now and i feel like my body kind of changed now to be a morning eater i never used to be my mom used to like force me to have breakfast in the car before school she used to like pack like at least like a little yogurt or a little bar and she would force me to eat that in the morning before we arrived at school so i feel like she would be really proud i enjoy like eggs i really enjoy a turkish breakfast i feel like that's my favorite but there's like a shortage of eggs at the moment because i think it's um i think it's called avian flu um with the chickens so there isn't much eggs at the moment so we haven't had eggs for i think like a week or two actually <clears throat> and if you find them they're really expensive um but i'm maybe gonna see if i can find them a little bit later um because i have to do a little bit of grocery shopping but i think for the most part we're just going to be around the house today and then later today we have a really exciting home event oh my goodness i'm so excited i'm gonna bring you along but i want to unpack the dishwasher and i think i'm gonna drink my celery juice oh my goodness who am i i used to drink celery juice so much this is just celery um ginger cucumber and lemon and i like to enjoy it over ice so i'm gonna have this before i have my coffee so i'm gonna do that as i unpack and repack the dishwasher these my hair is nice and curled for my event a little bit later and some content and i'm doing a really exciting unboxing with you it's right back there but yeah this is my outfit for today this little wrap dress is from h&m it's a little bit big for me so i actually took one of the sides and wrapped it to the back so that you can kind of see my um bodysuit underneath i think it kind of looks like one piece with a black at the bottom and then this kind of wraps asymmetrical and then these really beautiful flowy arms so yeah this is my outfit i'm just wearing um little slippers this carpet needs to go back to the bedroom but we'll do that a little bit later first unboxing I have wanted one of these for the longest time, like literally since they came out and I'm just so excited and so happy to be unboxing this with Lily Beast today. This one is by the brand called Xiaomi and it's a robot vacuum X10 plus, which means she is a vacuum and she's a mop all in one and I'm so excited to unbox this with you now. <laughs> I'm not going to be sweating with mopping and vacuuming anymore. Okay, remove protective coverings, install the side brush, connect to electrical outlet, and trying to film a TikTok, YouTube, Reels all at the same time. <laughs> Love a multitasking girly. Okay, let's continue. Brain 
said he would bring me lunch when he comes back from work a little bit later and just before I leave for my event but all of this unboxing and filming and setting up is making me a little bit hungry so I'm just gonna make a little pick me up um, just before lunch and I've been loving this snack so you literally just take my jewel dates I'm gonna wash them and then pat them dry kind of half them and then you can put peanut butter if you want and then I just melt a little bit of chocolate on top and then I'm gonna put it in the fridge while I finish setting up and then as I'm done I can enjoy that I also think I'm gonna have an apple with some peanut butter and this lint I recently tried it was actually on like a clearance I think because people are not buying it I don't know so normal lint was on average I think it's like 75 um for a slab like this but this was 35 so I was like let me just take two I'm sure I like it and it is delicious like honestly I love the taste of the sesame seeds in here so I'm gonna use that with this um little sweet snack award goes to I don't know you ladies can guess <laughs> Brain came home with some sushi and that's it in my leg steamed buns steamed buns mm. same custard also, buns ooh custard and I'm assuming chicken or pork or beef no? it's probably pork So back to the robo back. Lunch was delicious. I think I'm gonna have my little sweet treat in the car on the way to my event. So in the previous vlog, I kind of rearranged the living room and I had it in mind with this robo back because you need to plug it in and needs like a little home to go back to. So we have like an outlet, um, like a plug socket behind this couch. And then we have one behind the TV and behind that sideboard. So I don't know. Those are the three options. Um, because we have little steps down there, I don't think the Robovac is going to go down there. I think it's majority just going to live here. I don't know. It could actually work in this corner. But then I would potentially have to move up this sideboard. And I don't know about the curtain if it's going to be a problem or not i don't know let's just keep it on that side for now and then we'll see signs that you have a husband in your house part i don't know how many parts i've done i think i've done two on tiktok <laughs> balls and my feet are already drying <laughs> it's so hot outside I've had the aircon on the whole day <laughs> and I didn't realize it was so hot out but I'm leaving um, 
like an hour early because I have a dress fitting with Anal Boeta. <laughs> I'm so excited for a really, really exciting event for next week. So the Cory Craft event is literally like just down the road. And I'm really excited about it. I got invited by them to do like a little sofa talk in Cape Town a couple of weeks ago. Um, I can't even remember when it was, but I wasn't available at the time. I think it was around um, like brain surgery time. Um, I can't quite remember, but they invited me to a little launch. So I'm really excited. is absolutely beautiful oh. in my heart in my soul craft event yesterday and this morning as I was getting ready it just kind of made me think of my mom's career if you didn't know she was an interior decorator and designer for I think over 25 years I think close to 28 even 30 years she started really young creating curtains and now my brother took over like her clients since her passing because he worked with her but she did like decorating and just walking in the store and just kind of myself growing a passion for it over the years as I grew up. Like I literally grew up taking naps on scatter cushions and playing with different rolls of materials and I even remember like you know trying to make money and my first ever job as a teen or like a little girl growing up you know because extra money little pocket money and I even used to do it just for fashion so my mom would take me shopping for extra clothes I used to help her around the um, their workshop she had like 10 plus um, seamstresses and I used to help them with like little tasks like um, you know really tiny things um that didn't really matter too too much but i just had the best time doing them and i used to visit clients with my mom and she used to brag about me so much not me getting emotional um but just kind of walking throughout the store yesterday with the launch of the elovo cory craft i just it's almost like that passion has kind of um lived on in me and i truly have like such a love for decor and just pretty things in general whether it's 
lifestyle decor fashion beauty hair makeup like i literally just am such a pr lover of pretty things pretty things lover um but yeah um i wanted to share that story with you so getting to go to the launch of a new Cory craft store a store that i find <laughs> literally feels like home because i feel like my home kind of looks a little bit like a Cory craft store i have the same carpet they had this carpet this rug at the store and in so many different shades it's called i believe the um valentina i linked it on my stories because i always get questions on this rug i got it from Cory craft it was like my dream rug i saw it as we were like renovating this house and it took like seven months to renovate and then when we moved in like i couldn't find this exact shade because they change the shades all the time they now have like a dark blue one with like shades of dark blue and they also have like shades of dark green and black but i wanted the like neutral gray one so this one is in the shade neutral and i found it and i was so happy like i was the, like the happiest girl until this day we've had this rug for over a year now and i'm still so so in love with it and i'll show you what i got um when brain comes home a little bit later we'll cook together as well because i forgot my bags in the car and he's at work today but i wanted to get started with this xiaomi mop and have it it's fully charged now and i'm gonna let it mop out the living room and the living space i think it's gonna be majority like here in this space so let's do that together okay so now i'm starting the um mapping process because yesterday it was charging and it's already mapping out everything you see now it's seeing that it's there's a mm -hmm. there's a stair mm -hmm. clever hey <laughs> 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 Oh, she's just going and going. <laughs> Start to vacuum and mop. Oh, such a clever girl. Look at that. Oh, it's an absolute dream for under the sofa you can see over there it's busy um, mopping where the carpet isn't and as soon as it detects the carpet it starts vacuuming that is amazing I thought it was going to struggle here because the sideboard is so low, <gasps> but it literally like, <laughs> oh my gosh, this thing is so clever. <laughs> Look at 
literally quite literally the easiest and quickest dinner it's friday so we'll probably have like popcorn and maybe some snacks later it's five o'clock so yeah we're just it's hot so we want something light something quick something easy so i literally made a steak and i cut it up in little strips and i put it inside i lined the wrap lined <laughs> I kind of smeared the wrap with some cottage cheese for some extra protein and then I just cooked some McCain frozen veggies. I just took the African stir fry, a little bit of sauce and so quick and easy. I have one wrap and Brayton has two. <laughs> I'm busy watching <laughs> Love is Blind but I remember that I didn't show you what I got from Cory Croft. Literally so stunning. And can I just say, I am loving this vibe. Sitting here watching TV for the first time, actually, <laughs> since moving everything around. And I'm absolutely loving it. I don't know if I'm going to put these in here or in the bedroom. But that's what I love about having kind of like one style all throughout the house is you can literally use different pieces in different spaces all the time so i love that it has like this kind of there's a name for this i forgot what it what it was but it's kind of like this sherpa vibe and then it has like a little bit of a suede off-white cream that's very close to the couches, but the front is white. So I got two of those, and then I got the Cory Craft signature set because my home is about to smell like a Cory Craft store. What do you think of the pillows? It's pretty. It's gonna look good in our cupboards. <laughs> Why are you saying that? Exactly, everyone. All, All of the other pillows. <laughs> Can you What's tell it? me what the scent is? Smell it. Yeah. This is Cory Croft Uncle. This is the Cory Croft Uncle. Smells like the shop. Yes, yes, so a man we did it. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Move your feet. This is it. I'm gonna spray you away. Can I have my seat back? been like a day or two and shit I forgot to take my ring off um I'm going to the gym <laughs> I haven't been in a gym in years like I think pre-covid during covid we stopped our membership and then we moved we moved here and in 
that period we kind of started our own little gym inside our house so we have a gym and we have equipment but I feel like I'm making excuses for myself I'm just being honest I'm making excuses I was really good before the wedding but obviously now I'm not really like I feel like I'm not obviously not on a diet not training for anything so it's kind of it, I don't have any motivation so the past couple of weeks I've been really trying to just make it part of my lifestyle again and just do movement and I know for a fact by my personality if I'm gonna go at something really hard I'm gonna get tired and I've done that in the past that's just like I'm really like an all-or-nothing kind of girl like I either do something a hundred and ten percent full-on or I'm just not doing it at all like I'm not like a half ass kind of person and it's not like we're half assing fitness and health and nutrition it's all about balance so that's what I'm trying to find I'm trying to find a balance so I'm doing it with a friend we're gonna be doing body pump once a week they have a couple of classes each week um, but we're gonna start with one I'm gonna start with one body pump class a week and then home workouts a couple of times a week not every single day I'm really just trying to like get back into it um, and I've been trying I've been you know doing that consistently trying to do that consistently um, some days are better than others but I think it's gonna be fun I think it's gonna be a little bit of a challenge I have a shit ton of hair oil in my hair my brain asked me even like just before I left now he's like is your hair wet did you shower before gym like no it's hair oil I'm trying to just I think I'm gonna do that every week people are gonna think like oh, who's this greasy girl coming to the gym every single week but I think I'm gonna do it every week do a little bit of hair oil as I'm at my body pump class and then when I get home I'll do my hair wash day and like you know an everything shower it's a little bit early um, the class only starts uh, in about an hour and a half or my friend and I agreed to be there in about an hour and a half but I wanted to go to Woolies first it's like the end of the day so it's not that hot anymore I wanted to just we don't have any food in the fridge and I was so busy the whole day like I literally I've been editing I've been like doing so much I haven't had time like time to even haven't had time I haven't had time to even cook a, a proper lunch darling so I've literally had smoothies and like nibbles of things because we haven't had proper food in the fridge the past couple of days um but yeah I've been rambling let's go to Woolies let's go to the gym Of a treat with the chippies and some of Brain's favorites. I got a potato bake. Um, I also got these. I love making like tuna sandwiches with those. And then bonbon cookies. I got some ready made meals just in case for the week. And then I got a whole bunch of fruit and veg for us. And now we are gonna make dinner. I believe I have been busy all morning 
Um, I haven't vlogged all morning just because I've been a little bit stressed. I had six deadlines for videos that I had to finish with the editing and like just whew, it was a lot but I made it. I took a shower, brush, washed and like brushed and did my hair. I'm gonna leave it like this. I'm gonna get into my car like this. Um, I have a car that's picking me up um, and then Brain will join me a little bit later because we're getting dressed. It's the Bellagio Diamond Privé. I can't believe it's been a whole year since this Privé. Last year's one was so spectacular and this year I'm going like all out. I have the prettiest dress. I showed you a little bit of a sneak peek. I thought I would just carry this vlog into the Privé because I feel like you're going to see it on Instagram anyways. So I tried to like show you a little bit of a sneak peek of the dress but now you're gonna see it <laughs> so i just wanted to tie everything all in together and just bring you on the whole evening bring you along i um i'm doing my own hair and makeup the team um offered to book someone for me but i just yeah i just had the busiest day today so i'm rushing against time and i think i'm gonna have to finish my makeup in the car so i'm gonna pack my things i have to leave in 12 minutes so i think i'm just gonna gather all of my things my shoes for my dress like small little bits and bobs i'm gonna pack a straightener in case i need to do any touch-ups and my hairspray a brush and like all of those things and then um we'll jump in the car and then we'll finish the makeup in the car and then we have like a little bit of a rehearsal run through of the event when we get there then we're gonna get dressed and like do all of the finishing touches and all of that and then it's the diamond red carpet the diamond privé red carpet i took all of my jewelry off um i don't have any earrings i feel like i look so weird without any jewelry on i feel like this top kind of looks like a grandma top in this clip and i'm wearing it with my denim skirt it's a little bit chilly out and i'm probably going to change back into this after the event um and i don't have i don't know i don't have time to change now so i'm just going to grab everything but yeah i took all of my jewelry off because i'm going to be wearing um i'm going to be dripped in diamonds tonight
so not looking as glamorous as last night but at least the hair is giving i just washed my hair and i'm about to get ready for the day i'm already like on to the next vlog i'm getting nice practice in for vlogmas that's literally around the corner like two weeks away and black friday is here like literally the last two months of the year it's just going by so crazy fast but yeah i'm nice and organized with my black friday sales i already um placed an order i have a few things in my cart i'm having my eye on one day only take a lot um the xiaomi vacuum um and a couple of xiaomi items were they were on like a 25 to 35 percent sale on superbalist so i'll have a look and see where um the sales are and i'll try and link them for you i'll also link bellagio's um website because they went live with their black friday last night i was like scrolling the website and i was like can't we just all be victoria beckham with 15 engagement and wedding rings i'm at least on two so i have 13 more to go <laughs> brain has 13 more to go i'm kidding but yeah they have such gorgeous pieces and i will link them i don't have the biggest like wish list but i did order a couple of really nice things for the festive season that i'll share with you in an upcoming vlog i'm so excited to get them and um, yeah i have some nice vlogs that um are to follow i also went home with the most beautiful um pointer diamond mementi pendant it's like a little diamond shape and then it has a pointer diamond at the bottom and in my birthday vlog i got to um, i shared it in my birthday vlog i got to invite a couple of friends to join me for a bellagio brunch and they got the same thing so it's like we all have the same pendant and it's really nice and special so i hope you enjoyed this vlog and that you are excited for many more to come oh my goodness this hair is giving i hope my vlogs are giving as well and that you are enjoying you know spending a bit more time with me i'm really trying my best with vlogmas and trying to get a lot of practice in um i'm just a bit slow with the editing which I don't have a lot of time for because I have a ton of other things to film, a ton of events, a ton of campaigns, but I'm trying to just like not be as, um, you know, I'm, I'm so worried about lighting. I'm so worried about quality, but I feel like this time of year, it's more about like spending the time together and that also brings quality at the end of the day. So a lot of vlogs, um, where it's going to be filmed in the dark and just like cozy vibes end of year vibes i hope that's okay i really just want to vlog more this um vlog miss and try and get as many vlogs out as possible so i hope you're excited i'm excited to see you in the next one and i love you so so, so much bye Lizzie.